So, since I'm here, why not just check a little bit, you know, to my subscribers and all. I don't even know what I want to talk about. <laughs> but anyway, how's your summer going? My summer? It's not really summer for me. It must be summer for the kids because it feels no different. The only difference is that I'll have somebody home all the time who will be eating a lot. <laughs> That's the only thing about it. But, um... What I like about the summer being here in the UK though is that, you know, sometimes, especially like if I miss Jamaica, being that it's in the summer, it does still, it still rains a lot sometimes, mind you, even in the summer. Um, because I think even last week, there was so much rain, like most of the days. Um, yesterday yeah like sometimes it just can't it just raining 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 but sometimes it's actually so nice when you can wake up and you open your windows or you, you open your blinds or your curtains and you can see the nice sunshine coming in and to be honest i think i'm just made for the sun really because i'm i'm literally so happy when there's some sun outside if it's if it's dark and gloomy outside trust and believe that i i will be like that for the day like gloomy moody whatever so i mean you know being here in the uk it really sometimes like helped me to like really value f true friends and family and things like that because sometimes that's all you have to actually keep you i mean virtually though mind you most of the times because it's not always a case where you will have people that you know around you but if you do have people that you know around you sometimes it does help you know like to network a bit you know spend time together hang out do stuff you know eat together laugh together chat together whatever the case might be because sometimes you do need that because as i said with this weather over here <laughs> it is enough sometimes to just drive you insane like you know just going to work coming home and things like that and it's so gloomy outside you don't want to go outside you don't want to do anything or whatever but yeah wherever you are you know sometimes just try to network even if there's an even if there isn't anyone that you know you know from home or whatever the case might be you know try and put yourself out there this is me talking about putting myself out there like i would actually but maybe if i need to i will but i do thank god for you know like the few persons around me who i can actually network with who actually sometimes you know can you know give a little word of encouragement and you know can i keep you going and things like that um that's it's it's really good so yeah um so that's about that in terms of plans for the summer like what i do plan to do is that you know because caitlin will be home for pretty much like about six weeks there about i'll i'll try you know to like get out more like especially on my days off to like do things go to places try to know places because i don't just want to just live here in the uk and not go anywhere not do anything um one of the, the main purpose of me being here in the uk is that i will you know explore put myself out there you know know places experience things and stuff like that and that's really some of the things that i would want to you know achieve throughout this summer holiday especially when the weather will allow so yeah tell me what are some of your plans for the summer um anybody going to a new country a new parish or doing something new going somewhere different changing job whatever how is it that you plan to spend your summer I mean, I'll just be working. I, I do work four days a week. So, you know, for the next three days, definitely at least two days or one day even. I just want to get out there and do something, no matter how simple it is. Today, I went to, um, 
aside from going shopping in Asda Bold and I don't normally go there this is my second time going there and this is my, actually my first time shopping there but I do know that usually it's a good place to get like your back to school items and stuff like that um, and then I went to North Shields. So what I did, I did, I could have taken like the Uber here, there and everywhere. But what I did, I said, no, let me experience this. Like, you know, take the bus and, you know, know my way around to get around and stuff like that. So I had like a bus pass. I paid like probably like five, six pounds. And, you know, you just jump on and off, on and off the bus throughout the day. So after I was finished at Asda Bolden, then I went to North Shields. Um, that's where the Clark's outlet was. I mean, there are other stores on the complex, but I didn't need to go anywhere else there because it wasn't really the day for, you know, the school Ypa shopping. I was a little bit focused today. So, um, I went to the Clark's outlet and then there was this place across from it, like this bowling alley. It was my first time going there, but it was really nice. I really liked the atmosphere, you know, they had like a skating ring, um, the bowling alley they had like an arcade they had place for pool it had like a little food bar and like a drink bar and um quite a bit of stuff it's it was really nice there i did have a good little time so i mean sometimes no matter how simple it is you know get out there do something get outside the house and you know just make yourself happy because to be honest like there's no point just getting up every day just being sad laying in your couch and you know being sorry for yourself and things like that. i do that a lot sometimes but listen sometimes enough is enough so yeah even just a word of encouragement i don't know who needed to hear this today but whoever needed to hear this get up get out there and do something make yourself happy yeah so I'll see you in my next video.